<clears throat> so this is the um, tour of the spare bedroom that is open and available as of June uh, 2022. You can see the big windows comes around. You've got basically I'll just pan around here. Uh, plenty of power outlets. Um, this is a closet, pretty good closet space. Uh, this side is this closet, and then the other side is the next door uh, roommate's closet. And so, depending on how much stuff is in there, it kind of creates a double sound barrier. Uh, you basically got two two walls um and then you know the stuff that are in the closet so it'll help uh cut down on noise from room to room this is that room that has glasses on the other side this is peter's room here and we'll just come around and kind of go through here real quick um most of this stuff if not all is uh former roommates people who moved out so we can clear that out. There's a room in the garage where we can box it up or it can be utilized by people. Um, you know, whatever, whatever uh, space you might need. So closing these. This is a bathroom that would be shared with one other person. Uh, again, that would be the person with the, um, the opposite closet. Uh, bathroom, you can see the double door, so it's kind of nice. You have a little double privacy. You know, regular tub, shower head, and so on and so forth. Uh, cabinet space, three mirrors, towel rack, sink, everything works fine. Got hot water, cold water. Got drawers down here for um, toiletries. There's also, this is really neat because you've got, you've got all this space in here, uh, these cupboards. You know, wall to ceiling, so there's plenty of space for people, uh, you know, extra soap, hangers, stuff like that. So, you've got a lot of room in here. And a couple other closets here for overflow of, uh, you know, if you have jackets and other stuff. And uh, I think these boxes up here are also extra. Uh, they may not be, but... Um, whatever space we can make, we will we'll make it. And then close that one. Same thing here. I got a couple vacuums, some other bags, and and uh, looks like an attachment up there. Um, so basically, yeah, there's uh, there's plenty of space for clothing, for yeah, you know, pretty much anything. Uh, this is the kitchen. Um, again, space for food. Let me pan out here and get the whole wall. And you can see cupboards. Um, I take this cupboard here on the right um, kind of vertically because uh, you've got the pans and the, the drawer and then the cupboard up there. Um, this is a house microwave. Anybody can use it. Oven works great. Uh, I, I make some casserole sometimes. It, it, that, that, this unit works awesome. Uh, this dishwasher we just had installed last year. So it's... Um, it's you know it's all in good shape you can see i got some pizza over the weekend so um i've got some pizza in the fridge but there's space in the fridge and then we can make more space if need be pull out um a freezer you got that and then you got this up here that's got uh, the door that pulls out you can put other stuff in and, but plenty of space um there's even a little drawer in there that I think there's some stuff in there, but it's not really belong to anyone. So, uh, more. Actually, let me go back over here because I believe this is, or I guess this one. This is for food, dishes, you know, whatever you need, in addition to the other cupboards that uh, we saw when we first came in. Uh, again, more cupboard space here for overflow. Uh, pans and, and all that good stuff uh, outside nice little deck here I'm not gonna go out right now but uh, it's a you know pretty decent little deck we I'd like to get a barbecue grill you know it's summertime 
So that would be, you know, it'd be great to have that option. We'll come into the come into the main room, couch, coffee table, got an extra chair here. That little table over here. Um, also, you know, has a couple chairs we can move over if we all want to sit and talk. TV, it works. It's hooked up to a digital UHF antenna, so we don't have cable, but we do have local channels and uh, stuff like MeTV and Antenna TV and some other channels. You can watch some, uh, you know, uh, classic TV, which I happen to be a big fan of. Um, this TV, I don't believe, works but um, we'll test it out. I don't have an antenna for that. We've got some bookshelves in here. Feel free, you know, if you have books or, or other things that might look good on them, uh, feel free to use it, don't utilize it. This little table here, we don't really have anything really going on it, but uh, you know, you can certainly, you can certainly see it there. And then this room is kind of like the work room or utility, no, not utility room, but uh, there's room for desks. There's one of the roommate desks set up over there. Um, looks out over the front, and you kind of see the street, you know, in both directions. Um, and then this this corner could be utilized for you know a desk area, and, and just you know there's there this is a big house. There's a lot that can be utilized, and then. Got this little sunroom out here. Uh, it's it's got a couple. Well, it's got three doors. We don't really use this one, but there's this one that leads out just to the kind of the side yard, and then a um, couple chairs over here. Actually, this is the only one that works. This one is broken, so don't <laughs> you wouldn't want to sit in that. And then come out onto the deck, and you can see it's it's really big. You get a table, get around to sweep. We just had a bunch of stuff fall, so we haven't really swept and cleaned it off. And it's been raining a lot, so we haven't been spending a lot of time out here. Um, but that's certainly something that could be utilized, you know, especially during these summer, nice summer days. Um, we're facing north right now, so you don't get a lot of sun on this deck. But if it's a nice day, you're in the shade, so that's that's a really good benefit to that. And I'm going to just come back through here. We'll go downstairs. And... Pardon me if I pause to close doors and turn off lights. I, we have the furnace on right now. Probably don't need it. But it's a pretty nice day, but we'll leave it on. Because the other guys aren't home from work yet. Um, so we're just going to come through. And... See the entrance here. Again, following my dad's wishes when I was a kid, turn off lights when you leave a room. Um, this is the front door. We didn't really look at this, but we'll take a look here real quick. So you've got, you know, one way down here, some stairs here. Um, yeah, pretty self explanatory. And then you come in. And you've got this whole area here. Uh, we'll go downstairs because we already saw the upstairs. Um, it's my room over here. So, uh, and then opposite the garage. Uh, I know it kind of looks cluttered right now, but again, we can organize and uh, apparently change some light bulbs. I have light bulbs. I'll change those out. Uh, this freezer here, it uh, came with the house. I've got some stuff in here, and uh, I think Peter's got uh, some stuff down there. But we will we'll make room after room in here if there's any overflow needed from the upstairs. Washer and dryer. Uh, we just got this washer used. Uh, our other dryer, eh, not so, not so hot. But anyway, um. Uh, that's pretty much, that's pretty much the story there. Yeah, I think we've got a battery out in the, uh, uh, fire alarm there, so I'll take care of that. But, um, this is the house, and if you, um, have any questions, just let me know. All right, thanks.